This is very new kind of questions for you. All right. So how to tackle all these questions? That's what I'm going to tell you in this particular class. Now, before I go ahead, guys, as you all know, your term one are near. And uh, if you want to start your preparation uh, or say a rank booster or score booster course you want that you can get at Vedantu, the link for registration is mentioned in the description box of this video. As well as in the pinned comment and there if you'll apply this coupon code gpe pro you'll be getting 10 percentage off all right so guys remember 30th september is the last date for the registration for uh, vip enrollment for this academic year all right so first let's talk about the course which is there which is like a really good course for maximum of you out there this is the grade 10th term one crash course term one is very near and this is the need of this moment right you know that if you are like if you are still thinking like how to where to go how to prepare so this is the need which you are getting right now how to start the preparation which topics are important where can more questions be asked all these questions you can get your answer with this course term one crash course guys all right so the link how do you register for it just go to the description box of this video which you are watching and in the description box you will see CBSC 10th full chapter and uh, sorry so CBSC 10th full course so here avail all exciting Vedantu courses just click on this link all right now you have reached over here grade 10 CBSC now you can see grade 10 CBSC if you want to change it suppose if you want to change so grade 10th now here instead of term 1 term 2 we'll be going for term 1 crash course let's go for our term 1 crash course and you can see the term 1 crash course is available just at rupees 4500 for pro light and 4950 for pro classic Pro Classic would be a better course over here because you'll be getting access to unlimited uh, doubt solving on the mobile app. So you'll get access to 24-7 doubt solving support. You got doubt, just post it out and you'll get the solution for it. So that's a very good course guys you are getting right now. Now here you can click on change. Class 10th is over here. Select your grade. You can select grade 9 also. And these are the courses. You can go for the year long course also. You want that sir, although it is quite uh, like you want not only for term 1 but that to term 2 as well go for this year long course and then these will be the prices the prices have reduced now after applying gpe pro these are the prices for pro, pro light pro classic and pro plus all right beta so a very good course right now you can go for it and also understand like suppose if you take this course it's not like all the chapters will be taught only once okay you can study a topic as many times as you want because you get access to unlimited micro courses so chapter any chapter you want to revise take that micro course and start learning okay beta so the link is mentioned in the description box i have shown also how to go there okay now let's come to our topic which is uh, the tips for solving case study based questions okay so first thing guys let me tell this thing very clearly case study based questions only is nothing but an mcq type only okay it is again mcq type so it's not very different from mcq type the only thing is they'll start they'll give you a case study and what the what thing is important is to understand which points are important in that case study okay so it is very important like you read that case study carefully all right so how to start reading a case study uh, what should be done and all these things will be discussing now let's start point wise first point have a good command of concept and formula obviously you should be thorough with all the concepts formulas different types of questions you should have solved so that you'll get to know which values are important if i talk about surface area and volumes of cylinder i know radius and height will be an important topic if I talk about let's say linear equation in two variables, you know, which are the two variables that part is important. If I talk about quadratic equation, discriminant and our roots, all these are important in factorization. So different things you should understand of all the topics. So be good with your concepts, with your formulas. 
second thing whenever you start a case study based question beta read the whole case study and then read all the questions that what questions are once you have read the whole case study quickly just go through the whole case study it's take an idea what it is all about then read all the questions you have read all the questions once you have read all the questions then see in the case study that how these questions are related to the case study okay this is how you should take a look case study first look at the case study that understand from which chapter it is okay just go through it then see the kind type of questions what type of questions are there then read the case study carefully and see where are the topics okay tip 3 identify the demand of the question very important that's why i told you go through the questions also so that you will get to know what is the demand of the question and according to that you will get to know that in case study which questions which which line is important which values are important right so the next thing in case you find the question tricky or complex read the passage and the question again suppose you are getting stuck somewhere try to read it again all right one question you are not able to understand that how this question is related to case study start reading the case study again see read the case study one more time see you might have missed one important detail sometimes little details are also very important hai na two congruent triangles we miss congruent two triangles so whole question becomes very difficult but once we get to know two congruent triangles the whole question becomes easy so if you find a question difficult read the passage one more time and see have you not like have you missed any detail or not okay then once you have understood the question you have understood the question always 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 look at the options answer is in front of you try to eliminate as well if suppose you are not able to get the answer elimination also is there so elimination option all or elimination method also try to learn at least try to remove which answers will not be correct so that even if you are making making a silly mistake you'll get to know these will not be my answer okay elimination always works next guys practice so practice from different sample papers cbse has also released sample papers from there from any other book you have and see what kind of questions are framed all right so solve some case study based question you know we are also doing case study series so through that you can see that how kind what kind of questions are asked and how the questions are related to the passage so i have told you i'll show you the passage in the case study series then i'll go for the questions so all that is very important then focus more on the chapters which are frequently asked some chapters like say uh, L, uh polynomials or quadratic equations all right so these are the kind of topics uh, from which the case study has been uh, case study can be made really very good triangles is there so try to see what kind of case study based questions have been there focus on those chapters as well also you know in the sample paper main thing is four questions you have to do out of five given questions right so you can leave that means you can leave one question okay so guys remember this thing that whatever question you want to leave whatever question you want to leave decide that strategically see which question suppose if you know the answer for all the five questions okay so leave that question which you think will will involve the la, like maximum calculation okay if you don't know any one of this obviously you have to leave that okay so in this we decide which question you need to leave if there is one question which you know like it will take a lot of calculation so don't be like oh examiner i will impress them by solving this question no one is going to be impressed because it is an mcq based question no one is going to see what you are solving so try to be like focus which question you want to reject don't be like you know all five so first four you will do fifth one you will not do see which question is more likely try to remove that or which question you don't know okay so these are the eight tips beta read the passage carefully read the questions if you get stuck in any question re read the passage be thorough with your concepts all right and the important thing four questions out of five so understand which question to re uh, reject and elimination method always remember which can, which options can never be the answer all right okay guys so remember every morning every morning you are waking up you have two choices continue to sleep with your dreams or wake up and chase them and make them possible make them true right so it's your choice what you want to do now like them be a dream only or chase them get them all right okay so link for the registration i have shown 
uh, is in the description box you can take the year long course as well all right and there also you are getting unlimited micro courses as well so these are the dates uh, in which the the sessions are starting the batches are starting so do not wait a lot start now because the more time you are waiting you are wasting your time and also if you take the course now the the time the duration in between you can utilize for using what uh, say using micro courses all right guys so the link is in the description box and see you soon thank you so much for joining if you enjoyed if you like what i said please don't forget to like this video share this video with your friends thank you so much guys i'll see you soon bye bye sayonara khuda hafiz to all of you bye bye